Okay, elephant in the room. I know, I don't, I don't have a mustache anymore. My stream made me shave it. Uh, so if you would like to bully me for money, uh, go ahead and check out my live stream. You'll probably enjoy it. But anyway, that's not what we're talking about today. I know I look like an egg. We actually have kind of a big story today. You might've been hearing rumors that Jagex is for sale for quite a few months now. However, we have some new information according to Sky News. A firm called CVC is in talks to buy Jagex for 900 million pounds or roughly $1.1 billion in real people money. Apparently, it's going to be happening fairly quick, too, because according to the article, uh, CBC had seen off competition from a number of rival bidders and could sign a formal agreement to buy a controlling stake of the company within days. It also says that a number of private equity firms were said to have expressed uncertainty about the company's business plan and development pipeline, denting hopes of it achieving a reported $1 billion valuation, which is real and true. This could be huge. But I want to allay some concerns. That's not exactly how private equity works. I don't think this is going to have a world ending effect on our game, at least in terms of like microtransactions. I know that's what everybody is concerned about because I know typically when a PE company comes in, they typically tend to like squeeze as much money out of the company as possible uh, and then sell it off, make their money, whatever, however it works. But they're not like all controlling gods, right? Like they still work with the company to make sure that their ideas are long-term profitable and work. And if they immediately came in or like, hey, we need to put MTX in old school, there would be a lot of pushback, not only from Jagex, but from the developers as well. And I found a pretty interesting comment that I think is the most likely way this is gonna go. Posted by this guy, Bill, on Reddit. It says, uncomfortable truth, most of the player base would grumble, but tolerate if the cost of membership went up. There's not infinite elasticity, but I envision there's a decent pricing runner before user attrition outweighed the benefit of charging more per user. You guys can pause it and uh, read the rest, but essentially the worst I think we will realistically see is an increase in membership price which is not the end of the world, but we don't really know. I think only time will tell. This is not a finalized sale yet. We will keep you guys updated with all the news. However, we are going to go on to some clips. Up first is Straw Hat Danny with a hardcore Iron Man versus Cerberus. Boom. Thank you for the prims. Alrighty, boys. <laughs> Bro, it is just working, you know? It is It is working, you know? Just call the drama. Razlox is one of the many Iron Men who is suffering in the uh, corrupted gauntlet. <laughs> Truly, it is meta hell, bro. Let's see how he's doing. <laughs> yes! Yes, finally, we got it! Valor's got a hard clue stack that's like nearly 300 clues. Certainly, he gets something good, right? Holy! <laughs> what the f? Nah. Bruh. I got venomed at the end of that kill. Collection log slot. <gasps> no way. Oh, I mean, how's that my first item, bro? Okay, we went 754 kills for a jar of sand, bro. Jar of swamp, sorry. <laughs> Get buddy. Welcome to old school RuneScape, man. Up next, we have Mr. Mammal teaching the PKers a very valuable lesson. What? Good fight. <clears throat> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Yippee. I don't have a single clue what's going on in this clip, and the music is extremely loud, but here's Sandy. Nothing I have. Oh my god! Oh my god! Yes! And I've had better nights of sleep. <laughs> Yeah, Pure spam doing some edge PKing. He ate, never mind, we're not going for anything. We're waiting for that massive XP drop on the blister. A 50 plus is what we're looking for. I can risk this. Wow, he can hit 80s. That was a move and a half from me. Fair play, an 80? Holy shit. He must have Berserker ring imbued or something. Very surprised he can hit an 80 in that setup. I love that when other PKers die, they like smash the keyboards. But Pure spam is just like, oh, dearie me. <laughs> Oh, oh, cheerio. <laughs> Technically, if you say B-ring before every kill, you'll get a good clip like this. So heads up to up and coming streamers. B-ring. Collection logs locked. What? Oh. Woo! We're doing the cartwheel again. Also, this is a disgusting log. This is loot from 1,000 TOA experts. He said about half of them are massing 8-man 410s. That is so much money, dude. Show us some 50 wax. I wish I could show you some 50 wax, man.
Also, shout out, this is a YouTube series, so just to let you guys know, check out his YouTube. Our clips are delayed if you watch him live because we want to wait till he uploads his videos before we post the clips. But they're really good videos. I recommend you check them out. Shout out Dino, that British... Never mind, I'm not going to say it. One HP in the kitchen, who would have guessed he was cooking? I was forced to say that. I didn't write that. Thank you very much. <laughs> I told you! I told you! Don't ever doubt me again! Okay, this is also kind of a cool story. I wanted to put this in today. A little bit of context, okay, before we start. Um, two hardcore Iron Men decided to take a learner into TOA. Two of them. One of the hardcores is the rank one TOA for hardcores. So that's pretty huge. Um, his lasagna finished because he was cooking lasagna. It's Lynx Titan or something. So he goes to get it out of the oven. You could like hear the timer go off in this video. And the other hardcore Iron Man him out, but that was his last crystal. So watch this. The tricky one is yellow. Oh, f my lasagna is done. I'll be right back. <laughs> Explain the rest of Wardens. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so oh, uh, lasagna he basically said everything that needs to be done so after if you don't Probably that's not. fine yeah you would spec it and then you'd switch to your next best uh melee weapon um uh, oh we started oh my we god started. did you start it i did, did not oh, no oh no can you tp him out oh my god we... yeah i'll have to tp him out should i i should eh? yeah yeah uh it depends if he's quick give it uh, a second we... Oh yeah. Yeah. Get him out. You should get out too, dude. Oh That's my god. Funny. Oh my god, I can't. Get up, get up. I can't. That was my last mm -hmm. teleport. Oh god. Oh, no. Wait, what the f Oh get my started. god. What happened? How is there a way for me to get out? I just got back. What happened? Uh it started okay. early. Do we DD? I think I'm dead. Oh it's teleport out, dude. Get the f out of there! I'll I can't, I use my teleport on you. Book of the dead, 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 book of the dead. Holy f***. Holy Holy f***. Holy f***. You could shout on that. Oh my god. Holy f***. That's crazy. You forgot your crystal? No, I used it for you, bro. Huh? He had one left and he used it on you. Oh my- oh. Because the disco was spawning while you were gone, bro. I didn't want you to die. Holy f***. At the end, however, he realizes that he could leave with the Book of the Dead. Dude, he was so close to dying, like, four different times. Uh, also, here's the lasagna that got made, by the way. Oh my god, that looks awful. Is that what rank one hardcores eat, dude? Holy sh**. Anyway, he lives another day, but uh, I look forward to the death clip on Behemoth next time. Man. Woodward's also doing a Bronze Man series, and he gets something absolutely massive. Dead. Oh! Oh! No way! No way! No! 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 Wait! That's a volley. That's full void and everything, bro. Like, that's hella upgrades, bro. That is hella upgrades. Now this did take two weeks, but we do have the first confirmed person dying to Scurious. Ah! Ah! In my opinion, the only thing better than wiping your whole team is gaslighting them after. Where's the middle? Oh. Who's missing it? Oh my god. Dying on my hard Dude. Fire, man. Complete. You were just standing there! Who did it? Who PJ the team? Who f***ed up? standing there, Ziggy? It was, it was not me. I hit all my skulls. <laughs> I love seeing a nightmare clip because it means someone is actually doing this boss in 2024. No shit! No f***ing way! That's the one drop Rory needs. That's like literally the one drop Rory needs. Also, huge grats extended to Mr. Not a Clue. He did max his account. Huge for that guy, congrats. Max total has been reached. <laughs> I had to get it, I had to bait it because, you know, I wouldn't have got the ore if I didn't. Thank you, thank you. Oh, it's done. Thank you, thank you. Let's go get those capes. Unfortunately, this next clip is muted. However, this guy has nearly 1200 KC with no scythe at TOB. I'll try to react for him. Oh my god, I have a purple! No, never mind. I'm not gonna do that. Just watch the clip. I love this clip because it was screen recorded on a phone. How did you do this? How did how did somebody do this? Oh! I got something. <gasps> 
I, I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't see it. I don't see it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what is it? I don't know. Don't tell me. <laughs> anyway, gamers, that is all we have for you tonight. We love you. To send us out is none other than It's Will. Can you rate Drake's meat? He's got a hog on him, huh? My God. I mean, let's be honest here. Bro's got a piece. My goodness. I mean, yeah. <laughs> it's, that's, um, I mean, guy's got a hog on him, huh? I mean, let me tell you. <laughs> wow. I love you all. Have a nice night. I will see you guys tomorrow.